This is Kevin, and I'm just going to provide a quick overview of one of its systems. In this case, it's going to be the uh, main kind of power distribution board, power module. This is probably one of the few complete systems at this stage, and it's intended to be the, the kind of primary kind of source, the primary kind of uh, place that the power all runs through. The batteries all feed into here, and it then distributes power out. And so you've got to with terminals or points on the side. This is for the battery connections to feed in. At the moment there's just uh, two running in. Perhaps it's designed to accommodate more. At the bottom there are some similar connections under there which pop out the base and at the moment they are for the main kind of power feeds right down into the motor controllers. On the front there is a very basic kind of battery uh, power level with an LED array and we've got a little LED display which measures the voltage, current, temperature and a quick glance status which is the um, measurement based on the voltage and current if they're within norms and there's a single large kind of power switch which turns it on and off so I'm just going to open up the cover now the inside is a little bit kind of Crude, unfortunately, but it does serve its purpose quite well. So within here, we've got quite a bit of electronics are strapped to the top. It's mainly for kind of practical reasons. We've got some of the lower voltage parts. So down here, we've got the main battery terminals. So it can accommodate uh, kind of up to like four battery lines coming in, and it's just kind of with little kind of jumper wires kind of bust across there. And then we've got an LED there which shines out to the side, which is just an always on status for the uh, batteries. The power, the main power lines here, then run up to the top side of the switch. This is a three phase, 100 amp, uh, big beefy switch. Something I've had in the cupboard for quite some time. I've never had a use for it until now. It's a little bit of a stretch, but uh, I think it, it serves its purpose. It looks quite good from the outside. From the out of here, Power lines then run down. The earth runs straight through to the kind of common bust of the terminal down here. The positive line runs down here. And this is an Atto Pilot current sensor in line. It measures up to about four, I think it's a 45 amp current sensor. And that then feeds data back up here. The main power then flows through into this uh, uh, automotive switch block. The uh, main reason for that is it's cheap and easy to obtain. Fuses are kind of quite simple. I looked into various other sources, um, other types of fuse to use, and in the end I kind of kept coming back to these. They're cheap, easy to obtain, high current, and really simple. And out of here are the main power feeds for the various systems. At the moment we've got two heavy duty power lines along with the ground, and they run out to the motor controllers back and front. So back on the top, we've got this board here. This is a very basic, um, and a battery level meter. It's something I salvaged from the previous version of uh, a kind of robotic platform I built. It, uh, I believe it can calibrate for 12 volts or 24 volts and it's just kind of above or below. It's, kind of, it's quite a nice at a glance uh, view. Over here it's a slightly messy board. It's uh, an Arduino microcontroller in there and on this board here there's just a little uh, kind of uh, voltage regulator and temperature sensor on here and you've got the pins running off back to the uh, OLED screen behind. This taps onto the 24 volt feed over here. This, uh, this controller here, it, at the moment it just measures the current and voltage and temperature and feeds out to the display but it was set up with a, uh, a serial connection in mind to then feed that data out to other systems which were monitoring it. But uh, something I may or may not implement. So there you have it. So uh, that is the pretty basic but uh, at least completed power control system.